this weekend I had cause to uh, erase and wanted to wipe a couple discs that had some personal information on them uh, primarily because a USB drive had died, the controller had died, the disc was still good uh, and I didn't want to leave any stuff on it that might be of personal nature. I discovered this free download from diskwipe.org uh, it seemed to work very well be careful when you get to the page because you have all sorts of other downloads on it so when you get down to where it says disk wipe all you have to do is hit that it will start the download you will be questioned whether to run save or exit uh, if you run it it will not install on your computer you will be able to run it when you're done it disappears which is nice if you don't want to put extraneous crap on your computer uh, and that's what I did. I just ran it and when I was done uh, I exited the program and there was nothing left. So it's already on my computer so we'll minimize this and this is what the interface looks like. It gives you for the drive we're on here it shows you all the data for the drive if you plug something in after you bring it up click the refresh you will then have your drives this is a drive I happen to have done yesterday, uh, so I'm not worried about deleting anything, but always a good idea to double check before you decide to uh, format and wipe a drive. So from there, if you click wipe disk, it gives you your choice of file standards to use for it. You then get your choice of passes. You get a single pass you can get a one pass random, you can get government standards, triple pass uh, I use the US Department of Defense uh, triple pass for this takes longer, a 500 gig drive took about uh, four and a half hours to do so you go watch a movie uh, click next and you get asked the question erase all and they ask you to verify that. Helps to spell right. And if you click finish, it will ask you again. Once you click that, it starts and it will progress until finished. I am not going to click yes now because I already did it. So I will click cancel. You will then have your status bar here that will tell you what it's doing and how far along it is and you will get a rough idea as to how long it's going to take. Obviously the smaller the drive the quicker it will be uh, but it's a neat little program. I would also recommend that you don't click the icon on the taskbar. My experience with that was it disappears. So you don't want to do that in the middle of the format because then you're going to have to start all over again. Trust me, it happened to me. So, it's now off the computer. I'd have to go back to the website, download it again, and start over. So, you know, do not click the icon on the taskbar once you're going. Okay, other than that, neat little program. Work well, quick and simple, uh, or clean and dirty, like we used to say, and uh, does the job. So, good luck if you use it.